Okay, so I know I was supposed to watch Sonic 2 this week, but I have been told I need to watch this Chippendales movie. And when somebody tells you you need to watch a Chippendales movie, you watch a Chippendales movie. Because how often are you going to hear the sentence, you really should watch this Chippendales movie before it's spoiled for you? So here we are. I've been doing my best to avoid anything about this movie. I was told not to watch the trailers, even though YouTube being YouTube tries to recommend me so many clips of this movie and hence spoiling some things with the thumbnails. By the way, go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And even people on Twitter have been talking about this movie, so I've been trying to avoid all that as well. By the way, you can also follow me on Twitter. So let's see what all this hype is about. Huh? What's the first thing that pops into your head when I say Chip and Dale? Oh yeah, I, I do remember the TV show when I was a kid. I don't think I ever really watched it all that much, but I do remember it. And it pops into your head are these guys! By lunchtime, no one wanted anything to do with me. Is that a Simpsons character? Was that Homer? So I had to sit alone. Is that not Dora? What's her name? What's that character's name? She's on MTV. Dorothy? No, what was her name? It was a D something. You just didn't set up the joke right. I Is he CG? Wait. That is CG. Huh. He introduced me to Cheesy Crust. Yeah, it's like 3D but 2D animation. That's pretty interesting. So after graduation, we packed our bags and headed to California. Hello, potential new friends. Goodbye, eclectic group of bus passengers. Oh, I was kind of hoping the cat from Cat Stone's dance would come off that bus with them. And after landing a few small parts, we finally got the <laughs> What? They were in Full House. Chip, Dale, how would you like your own show? <gasps> Our own TV show. It was about a group of little detectives who would solve big crimes. <laughs> Birds. Huh? I guess the cat's in the bag. <laughs> was that a real episode? I do not remember. No. What the hell's happening? And cut. Oh, okay. Uh, nice work, everyone. Great job. Okay, so it's very much like Who Framed Roger Rabbit. To many more seasons of the Rescue Rangers. Cheers! Cancel. Dancing the Roger Rabbit with Roger Rabbit. Hey! What a party! Oh, are they flying a mouse? A flouse? Ta da! <laughs> Double O Dale? It's my new show. I'm gonna be a super spy. Why didn't you talk to me about it first? We tell each other everything. You've told me what you had for lunch the last 42 days. Pineapple pizza and a diet slice. Kill him. You don't put pineapple on pizza. You don't. Rescue Rangers was canceled that summer and Double O Dale was scrapped after the pilot. <laughs> but now we're ready to bring it back. Rescue Rangers 2.0 starring uh. now in new and improved 3D. <laughs> what is that like a uh, plastic surgery type thing for them? Pardon me, moi, Dale, but your followers, they believe the crowd is for you? <laughs> for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Dale, I'm going to be up on that stage too. <laughs> Ugly Sonic. And when the internet got one look at my human teeth and burned the place down. Okay. <laughs> I'm kind of glad I watched Sonic last week now. You can't hurt my feelings if I'm in on the joke. He didn't look that bad, did he? No, I don't think he looked that bad in the trailers. Uh, <laughs> I guess not. I don't even remember what Sonic's... Did Sonic have teeth in the movie? That's something I'll have to look forward to in Sonic 2 next week. I promise this time. I kind of, I don't know how I feel about their animation, honestly. The 2D, but it's 3D, you know? I know, like, some anime have tried doing it over the years, and it's been a little, eh. I like it. I like it. But it's pretty obviously a CG type of 2D. Oh, so, okay, so it is going to be like a detective thing where they have to find 
these missing cartoons. I'm in a heck of a lot of trouble, and I could use some help from a friend. I'd really appreciate if you could come and see me at my place. Oh. Quick, get in while the coast is clear. Oh. Monty, it's you. Overall, I still prefer the 2D version, but I can understand why they did this because it makes it fit into like an actual 3D world, but they still keep their 2DS designs. My love of cheese got the best of me. Cheese? Monty. I know, but I haven't had so much as a whip in weeks. I'm dairy free. Oh, so cheese is like, and if I can't pay up, they're gonna bootleg me. Did you hear what happened to that little guy, Flounder? Time to pay up, fish. Um, how about this? Isn't it neat? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, fellas. This is a genuine dingo hopper. Then change him around to try and sneak by the copyright laws and then smuggle him overseas. To China. Being forced to make terrible bootleg movies. <laughs> oh, so that's how they're made. I would believe that. <laughs> I know Gadget and Zip, I missed you also. Yeah? How are they doing? Oh, they're great. 42 kids and counting. Wow. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> what? Gadget's eyes and Zipper's wings. Oh, God. The mouse and the fly. Hmm. They do have flouse children. Dale. Chip. Hey. Look. I came here to help Monty, not get caught up in some Hollywood nonsense, but I've got to go. Monty, if you're really in trouble, you know how to find me. Come over and try and help Monty ambush me. <laughs> Squidward has a star in the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Please, I've been fine without him. Garbage. Total garbage. Okay, you know what? That I believe that would be made. I, I'd be surprised if it isn't made. For cheesy crust pizza. Oh, um, I'm sorry, man, but we got other plans, you know. Is he a, is he a stripper? I just got a call from the police, and Monty's been kidnapped. What? Are you serious? Yeah, it's crazy. Hmm. Toad, take this to the lab. I don't recognize him. Wait, was he from Gumby? We've been trying for years to track those sleaze bags. A fella named Sweet Pete runs the whole operation, and he's always one step ahead of us. A truck. All done, sir. Oh, you scared the beans out of me, Steckler. Sorry, sir. Oh, wow. <laughs> I searched the perimeter. Why don't you just leave the real detective work to me, okay? <laughs> right. I'm Ellie Steckler. Uh, I am a huge fan. Really? But if you guys can find that bootlegging facility, I think you'll find your friend. We should go find Monty ourselves. Are you kidding? No. Who better to rescue Monty? We can't just let him rot in some overseas studio being forced to make bad movies. Just say China. Just say China studio. Disney doesn't have the balls to do that. Look, we can go to the cheese shop, see what we can find out about this secret facility and sweet Pete, and then pass it along to the officer lady. Wholesome public image to keep the cops away and bring for sale. That guy, he sells untraceable weapons. A shiny shoe. Now there's a plan. Stolen social security numbers. <laughs> Thanks, kid. Muppet fights. I really don't recognize any of these cartoons, except for like Phineas and Ferb's mom. And I never even watched that show. Do you have any stinky cheese? <laughs> you cops? Nah, no. Oh yeah, okay, so stinky cheese is like a drug or something. Oh, is Ratatouille gonna be in here? Or Speedy Gonzales? Or Jerry? Yeah, or Jerry? So. Remy. His name isn't Ratatouille. It's Remy. I don't think I've ever really seen Ratatouille all the way through. I've seen bits of it. I might have to add that to the list. Take a look at this photo. It's a friend of mine named Monterey Jack. Which is also the name of a cheese. Continue. Wow, this VIP room is incredible. I'm freaking out, dude. Is that Jessica Rabbit over there? I wouldn't mind seeing Jessica Rabbit. For, for, for research purposes, of course. This place looks weird. Where are we? It's like lower frame rate. Oh. <laughs> the cats. Ah, that's another movie on the list I need to watch, by the way, is Cats. 
Do you remember that weird animation style in the early 2000s where everything looked real but nothing looked right? Well, I think this is where they ended up. Oh, is um, Will Smith's Shark Tale going to be here? I'm trying to think of some really bad CG characters. This is like a movie I'm going to want to like look into more and see all the Easter eggs I missed. Because it just seems like every frame would have so many in there. Like, for example, you remember Shrek body wash? Uh, exactly. No one does. I remember Shrek ketchup. I'm surprised this Disney movie is referencing DreamWorks mascot. Hello. Peter Pan? <laughs> yep. Star of stage and screen. But you can call me Sweet Pete. What? You can't say nothing to me. I okay, his 3D, 2D model is a lot more noticeable. So I recruited other tunes to star in more movies. And bang a rang, now I run my own bootleg movie studio. Oh my god, did he make Cars Life? Or Little Panda Fighter? Or Frozen Land? Or Rats of Toying? I only remember the names of these movies because of the I hate everything video. Look for a way out of here. Uh, no. Come no. Uh. Ah! Try to grab something. Ah! 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 No. No. Oh, it's <laughs> Rapunzel. Yeah! You killed Rapunzel. You bastards. Lego Miserables. Miserables. Lego Miserables. <laughs> Love to see a Lego version of I Dream to Dream. You didn't learn anything of value except for that Sweet Pete wears the same step tracker that I do. Wait, those step trackers, do they keep track of everywhere you go? Yeah. We get the step tracker and we can trace it to find Monty. I made the whole squad raid Nickelodeon Junior Studios. And the tunes fought back. Paw Patrol attacked Sergeant Henderson. Doctors say he'll never have kids. <laughs> What's your favorite episode? Oh, I, I can't pick one. That's too hard. Didn't you say you were from Albany? Born and raised. Rescue Rangers never aired in Albany. My grandma, she used to tape all the episodes and send them to me. Hmm. Something's not right about that, detective. Wait, what if we did episode 45? 45? That's a good idea. On episode 45, you dressed up like a rat to fool me. You don't remember? I've been suspicious of her for a while, but a real fan, like a hardcore fan, like she says she is, would have immediately known what was 45 and like gave a plot synopsis of it. So, got my eye on you, Ellie. Ellie, we're in. Good. Now keep a low profile and go find Sweet Pete's soccer. Mom, I got the kids on the weekend. <laughs> really? <laughs> they have Randy Marsh in this? Okay, that's like rotoscoped. That definitely looked like a real human, but they just put like a cartoon overlay over them. There's oil. Aha. Uh -huh. oh, yeah, but how do you know what order to press the numbers in? That's something. Just because you know the numbers, it could be any combination of the three of them. Yeah, the only way that that trick would work, though, is if it was just one of the numbers had oil on it. That way he would just press it the same one three times. Oh, San Pedro docks. Yes, we got him. I mean, this feels, I feel. It feels too early for this to be the conclusion. So something's up. Yeah, it's not going to go right. Sir, I think I found something. Found it? Sneezy? They're all here. Oh, there's actually stuff there. I didn't think there would be. It's still warm. Must have just missed them. Hmm. Yeah, this place. Must have just missed them, so they were tipped off. I don't know. I was kind of starting to be like, maybe Ellie isn't a bad guy because she actually called in the SWAT team and did all this stuff. So I was thinking, maybe I'm wrong. But then they were tipped off. They were tipped off, so I still think there might be something up with her. Scanning them, rendering what they'll look like in different animation styles. Ha! Oh, 
Ooh. The machine is gonna try and surgically re-edit you, so try to avoid that. Scanning for Easter eggs. <laughs> Jimmy Neutron. Monty's mustache. He's been bootlegged. Hey, Steckler. Nice work today. I didn't think you had it in you. Thank you, sir. 3D in your face news. With this factory shut down, how does it feel to have made the city safer for tunes? All right, come on. That's, that's a pretty great joke. You said bootlegging takes 48 hours. We made it before then. I know. That it usually does. Yeah, that machine definitely wouldn't take 48 hours. Again, I'm still suspicious of her. Oh, there's definitely somebody. There's definitely an informant. You know what? Here. I've been holding on to this for some stupid reason. Now your collection is complete. I didn't even want to do double O deal. I think I just wanted you to tell me you needed me. That I wasn't just some pathetic chipmunk you found eating alone at school. I wanted this pog for some silly reason, but now I don't. Here, now your collection's complete. What? <laughs> Almond butter and, and gasoline. gasoline. But that's the Rescue Rangers cologne. Why would Buddy's office smell like that? Monty was literally the only person to ever use that disgusting cologne. Buddy's office stunk of it, which means someone had direct contact with Monty. Oh. Putty's too obvious. Think Dale, Ellie. Something has been off about her the whole time. Claiming to be a huge fan just to butter us up, she couldn't even name her favorite episode. Because she loves them all. No, because she's never seen any episodes. Speak of the devil. Joy, are you crazy? Don't pick that up. We don't know who we can trust. Now I'm questioning myself because now that they're pointing out it's Ellie, it makes me think that it's not going to be Ellie. Because I feel like the movie would save that for an actual reveal, but... Hmm... Oh, you want me to go fast? <laughs> That's Sonic's thing. Ugly Sonic goes slow. <laughs> Staring at his teeth. I'll run it by my producer go. later when I see him at the chateau. Oh, no. What are you looking at? Honestly, your weird dead eyes. <laughs> they are weird. <laughs> Super weird. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> <laughs> oh that was a great joke chip and dale together again never thought i'd see the day they have the updated blue design from the jungle book but they don't have bill murray <laughs> where's dale he'll be here keep your pants on oh i didn't even notice that peter pan had a rat tail the hair the hairstyle. When you came into my office, could have saved us both a ton of headaches. Ah. Oh, there is dip. There is dip. Nah. How about you, Freeze? Drop it, Steckler. What? What? Captain Putty. Nah. How cliche. Oh. Uh, huh. I don't know how to feel about this. On the one hand, I feel I was wrong. But on the other hand, the movie was also setting that up for it, you know? You derailed the whole investigation, and, and worst of all, you made me doubt myself. Oh, come That's on. That's not worst Don't of all. Don't be so fragile. Oh. <laughs> I agree with the villain on that part. Don't be so fragile. Doubting yourself is not the worst thing that could have been done in that situation. You know, people die. That's probably worse than your feelings. And again, like the movie, it kind of set that up, you to pick up the clues. But then again, that might have just been obvious in hindsight that they wanted you to do that and not think of the police chief, which you normally would in that situation. So they're playing like 4D chess in here and I got tiny brain. Not my fault, I have tiny brain. Why did you tell Dale to come? You should have protected him. I gave him a secret message, code. Come on! Ellie is sending a message, but what? Gadget is stuck in a lantern. Lanterns provide light by using fire. Fire is really cool, but also really dangerous. Someone is in a dangerous situation. Uh, like that time I dropped a bowling ball on my toe. Uh, Ellie has ten toes, and she probably likes Thai food. Ellie is tied up and in danger, and Chip is with her. It was putty where he was sweet feet the whole time. I cracked it. Our own coming, guys. Okay. Honey, someone's doing a cool pose in the driveway. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's still so weird. The sight of you lights my heart aglow. 
Rangers? <laughs> You're like known for constantly making terrible decisions. I know, right? Rescue Rangers! Away. Oh, please, you can blow out a match by breathing on it too hard. There's no way that match would have stayed lit while they're flying around up there. Stop, or I'll erase him right here. This didn't work out the way you wanted, right? You had big hopes and dreams, and, well, then the world just sort of breaks your heart. Are they going to talk no jutsu him? Believe it! No, they won't. That one's too cliche. It's true. You two really are the worst actors in Hollywood. <laughs> what the? Magnets. How do they work? That's an impressive rocket. Hidden Mickey, okay. <laughs> No, oh, what's it gonna be? Okay. Autobot, Woody. Huh. <laughs> I'm gonna wreck some! <laughs> wreck it, Ralph. Yeah, okay. <laughs> that laugh. That was... That laugh. What was that laugh? Oh my god. That sounded so recognizable. Uh, I want to say Maleficent, but no, it can't be. Oh, Cruella! It's Cruella's laugh. <laughs> 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 See, when they talked about Stinky Pete's, like, evil business, that's who I thought they were talking about, not Peter Pan. All the references, the references everywhere. <laughs> Terminator, why not? It makes sense, him be a, him be a T-1000 type villain. You know, I'm a oh, you're gonna freeze him. Yeah, freeze him with the fire extinguisher and smash him and say also la vista. <laughs> oh yeah, they're doing it. It was probably obvious. I, I can't feel like I've accomplished anything because this movie has been playing 4D chess with my head. Hey, buddy, don't be so fragile. Uh, it was a callback. Here, it worked on Fat Cat. Hit me. No, this time you hit me. Come on, where are they? <laughs> Things are getting weird. <laughs> That's not vindictive of this movie. I watched Kenobi before this. Huh? Birds. It would have been a pretty funny meta joke if instead of birds there were stars above his head when he hit him. Because in Who Framed Roger Rabbit, he tried to get stars but kept getting birds. D Dale, come on, don't mess with me. Not this time, man. Really? Dale? Huh. This movie may have tricked me a couple times, but there was no way I was going to believe that they had actually killed Dale. Mate! Oh, Monty! You're under arrest, you low-rent Gumby. He's all yours, boys. Nice work on this case. Uh, so, Chip, does this mean we are officially friends again? <laughs> sure. I guess some things are worth rebooting. Hey, do you think we could get like a pop star to do the theme song? Yeah, right. Like a super serious version, even though everyone just wants to hear the original. Yes, that exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. We all knew it was coming. Save the day, the 
<laughs> oh, yes. We want dark wing. We want dark wing. Say it with me. We want dark wing. I don't remember a whole lot about Darkwing Duck. Sorry, I forgot. Sorry. That was better than it had any right to be. Definitely in the spirit of Who Framed Roger Rabbit. I had a blast watching this movie. I loved some of the in jokes and the Easter eggs. Definitely didn't go as the more, you know, mature route as Who Framed Roger Rabbit did, of course, because there was actual murder and patty caking. But for this, being what it is, it was I. It was just fun. I didn't recognize as many characters as I thought I was going to. At the end of the day, whatever problems I had with it, it was just fun. And what more could I ask for for a movie like this? A good time. Yep. It's always the worst when it's like right at, towards the end of the movie. Like I probably got maybe like five minutes left of this movie and a train comes in. The train was fucking gone. What is there a fucking rear car honking the goddamn horn? There's a sweeper now. It's a fucking sweeper. What fucking year is this? <laughs> 